Good morning. Hello guys. I am going to be filming a day in the life today. I got the most requests for kind of a day in the life for an off day or when I'm not working, but I figured it would be more realistic um, to do a day that I am working. So today I'm actually going to Typhoon Lagoon with Rachel this morning for the first time, and then I'll be going to work afterwards. So I kind of take you guys in for part of that day and see what I do in a normal day. I just finished adding a little bit of curl to my hair. I like it like kind of more super curly right when I do it because my hair does fall out really fast. So then once it falls out, it's kind of wavy. Um, so I know this is gonna fall out pretty quick, but I just did a really quick little little wave for the beach, um, not beach, <laughs> water park. I need to slow down. But I'm about to head to Typhoon Lagoon with Rachel. We might stop at Cast Connection. So if we do, I will let you guys know. So we did end up going to Cast Connection and it was stacked. There was so much good stuff in Mickey's Treasures. I will show you guys a little bit um, of what we got once we get to Typhoon Lagoon. I got two ears, she got three ears. They were like between like five and 10 bucks. I think the most we paid for one of the ears was like $8. Okay, so here's our little Cast Connection haul for the day. I got this backpack, normally 60 for I think 14. And then I got a little spirit jersey for Stitch. And then I got two pairs of ears. So these were $7 with, like, I think, because we got 10% off. So it came out to about $7 for these. And then these weren't even in Mickey's treasures. These were just like up front. And then I got the 50th anniversary ears. I think these ended up being like $8 maybe, seven or dollars Oh, they might've been less. Yeah, because my total was very cheap. And I got <laughs> the same ears, the seven, I think they were $7. Yeah. And these ones were, what, like five? Something like that. They're, they're cute. really They nice. just have a little red on the corner, but they're cute. No big deal. And then I got these ones that were also like $5. I don't think there's anything wrong with no, them. No, they look perfect. At all. Like, seriously. So, yes. I love them. But this one, um, for the backpack, like, the only thing that's wrong is, like, there's, like, a little, yeah, you can kind of see it. There's, like, a little tear right here, but... Who cares, it's the bottom and I can like fix that up if I need to, but I don't see it being an issue. So I'm so excited. This is our first time at Typhoon Lagoon for both of us and we both come to Disney so much. So we're very excited to try it out. Okay. We made it. Woo! I'm so excited. Just got in and this is really weird for both of us because, oh, I'm gonna have to do the thing where I'm in front of you again yeah. because you're so tiny. <laughs> this is a throwback to my first vlog. Really weird because we come to Disney all the time. So we've never really been somewhere like new since we were little, but it was very easy to get in, which is so weird compared to the theme parks. Okay guys, so we actually just finished up our day here at Typhoon Lagoon. I didn't get to film a lot. I did a little montage for you guys of how cute this place is, but obviously we were on water rides and in the water, so we couldn't really film, but it was so much fun. I am so surprised how much there is to do here. I honestly, like I knew there was a lot to do, but I didn't realize how many different rides there are. And there was like an animatronic in one of them. It was so um, cute. <laughs> it was adorable. Misadventure Falls was probably my favorite. 
and then I really liked the Crush and Gusher. That one was awesome. That was like a roller coaster because you were going like up and down. We also went on the family tube ride. We didn't have time to do everything else, but we did so much that was all pretty much in an hour. And then we were laying out for like 45 minutes. Successful day, but we will be back very soon because we loved it so much. Rachel's off today, I'm very jealous, but I don't work till four, so we got a good chunk of the day in. Our plan right now is to head back to Flamingo. We're probably both gonna make lunch. We're actually being smart right now and we didn't buy food here even though we wanted to. I did get the mini donuts. They were really, really good with chocolate, so loved those. But they were pretty cheap and it was a good snack because I was starving. But I'm gonna make lunch and then I'm gonna get ready and go to work. This is the weird part of the day where I just went to the water park all morning and now I'm going home to get ready for work. I don't know how my life is real, but Whatever, I'm just gonna roll with it. We're waiting for the air conditioning to turn on in Rachel's car because it is so freaking hot. So we're just standing outside. <laughs> so we did end up getting Starbucks because there was no line um, across the street from Flamingo, but we did have gift cards. So still not spending too much money today, but we're gonna make lunch and she might go to the pool while I get ready for work. But Rachel's gonna drive me to work because the buses are being difficult as always. <laughs> I honestly love living at West. Like this is just so pretty all the time. I know. Did a little fixing of the hair and a quick change and I'm headed to work. Rachel's driving me and then she's gonna go lay out by the pool. Forever Uber. Yes, please. Can you forever be my Uber? Always. Amen. Oh. I only have a six hour shift today. It's a little shorter of a day. So I'm still done at 1030, but I will be back. Um, obviously I can't really video <laughs> anything at work. Um, I might go outside for my break though and just like chill outside. So if I do, I'll take you guys along, but if not, I promise I am not just trying to not video. I am just working and don't want to get fired. We had a very odd encounter at Typhoon Lagoon. There oh, was a man. Down. Yeah, so we're laying down just like sunbathing before we got in the water. And this man comes up and he like, he just asked like if the chairs next to us were open. And I was like, yeah, definitely. He starts like introducing himself and like asking our names. And he's saying stuff about how he fleed from Canada and like something about his ex-wife and we were like, kind of like oh, okay like why are you telling us and he kept like coming back over to us and then he brought his kids over and like introduced them to us and we were like what's happening he literally goes buddy this is Bella and this is Rachel and we were like um your babysitter's today. we were like what's happening I'm a little uncomfortable and then on the way out there was a mom literally screaming at her kid and her husband because the kid was tired like she was literally just tired and the dad was like carrying her and she's like make her walk like we can't go anywhere with her anymore she's always tired and i was like oh i felt so bad i was like what are we supposed to do That's some interesting happiest place on earth let's go also i didn't even notice but rachel missed the exit <laughs> so in that last clip she's like what, what the hell <laughs> it's okay i got another one we made it i will not be late to work Hello guys, I am on my dinner break right now. Uh, the fireworks just happened from Magic Kingdom. So I just saw Enchantment like I do every night at work, which is honestly makes my night. Like no matter how the night is going, um, it's just like so magical to see that while I'm working. It actually was a pretty quick day today. Um, since I only had the six hour shift, the past, how long have I been here? Like four hours before my break were really fast, honestly. Um, I went a little later on break today just because we were kind of busy during dinner time, but um, I just decided to come sit outside on my break, get some fresh air, because the movie is actually going on, the children's activities movie. So they're playing Enchanted tonight, um, but I'm kind of just chilling out here. I love being out here, it's so nice out. So I like just getting to get some air and you know, look at how pretty my place is. I have about 20 minutes left on my break and then I'm gonna take the bus home from work. Um, so I probably won't film any of that. Um, if I miss the first bus though, because it comes two minutes after my shift ends. So I miss that one a lot of the times. Also, sorry, it's so loud. I'm sitting right next to the speaker and the movie is really loud. So apologies if you can't hear me. I hope you can, but we'll see when I edit this. She is the moment. Okay guys, I just clocked out and I am about to get on the bus, hopefully. It's supposed to come in three minutes, so I should be making it and Grace will be on my bus too. But um, it is Run Disney, Disney Princess race weekend. So it is a big weekend for Walt Disney World. It is gonna be packed here, the roads are gonna be closed. So it's gonna be interesting getting to work tomorrow, but there's so many crowds right now. The contemporary, a lot of our guests are participating in the marathon. So very exciting for them. Look at my view though, she's pretty. Getting off work is always the best because you can see Space Mountain and the castle and the beautiful view of the contemporary, obviously. Update, we made the bus. I'm with Gracie. We're on the bus. Hey. Grace worked at Polynesian today, so she wasn't with me at contemporary. <laughs> but I went and watched her children's activities movie, but she wasn't there, so it was 
very lonely. It was sad. I almost cried. Yeah. We made a joke about that tonight because I had a guest that thought, like, they accidentally said Space Mountain was being turned into Princess and the Frog. And one of my coworkers was like, Oh, like they're going to space to visit Ray and Evangeline. And I was like, wait, are you on to something? I hadn't watched that movie beginning to end. Princess and the Frog? They we just watched it the other day. I wasn't paying attention. I was asleep. Hello. As oh, always, wow. me and Grace went first to Rachel's room before our own when we got home. We walked in. Um, we went to the community center to get a parcel pending for Grace because she had a package to pick up. Yep, there it is. not opened it yet. Um, and then we stole lollipops from one of the conference rooms. And they were like, uh, what are you doing? And we're like, taking lollipops. They're like, okay. So. Fives. <laughs> it worked out, I guess. Me and Grace are finally home. <laughs> Grace's face when I just started filming. Um, we're making food. She made rice aroni. Yeah, she does. I'm making dino nuggets because, duh. I'm in a very vulnerable position right now. <laughs> Don't worry, I won't show you. I just didn't want to vlog in my room. I feel sad without you. <laughs> okay, but I think my food is ready now. So let's go see because I'm starving. It is currently 11.30. Just to give you guys an update of like, when we get home and stuff. Me and Grace both got off at 10.30 tonight. So we got the 10.35 bus and we got that home. And then we got home around 11-ish, but we were at Rachel's and then now we're here making food. Um, and we're probably gonna go to bed in a little bit, but we don't go to bed too early because we get home so late. So I'm probably going to try to sleep in tomorrow, but we'll see. I don't really have any plans before work, so I don't know. Oh, I do have an update though because I put this little spirit jersey on Sitch that I got at Cast Connection today. And look how cute. I just love these. They're so cute. I need to not buy more because they're all so cute that if I start buying more and like making it a thing, like I know I'll want to buy more. Um, but I know I don't need more. I just, Dawn is a classic, obviously, and then Stitch was so cute. My mom got him for me when I she was visiting, um, and then I got this cute little outfit for him today, so, so cute. He's sitting in our apartment, just like right by the TV, which we can't really get to work lately because the Wi-Fi is really bad here right now. Um, so lately we've been having issues when we're watching movies, which a lot of nights we watch movies. Um, that's like a very typical, I'd say like half the days every week we watch a movie. Um, just like hang out on the couch and everything. Um, but we're not doing that tonight because our other roommates are asleep and we're both really tired from work. So that's what normally we would do, like make food and watch a movie. Okay guys, I think I am gonna go to bed because I am so tired from being out in the sun all day and then going to work. And I don't really know what time I'm gonna wake up tomorrow. I'm probably gonna sleep in, um, just relax before work because today it was kind of going all over the place. It was a pretty typical day. Um, obviously we ended up going to Typhoon Lagoon, um, but a lot of times we'll go to parks before or just like grab Starbucks or just um, kind of hang out before work. But other days we're just waking up really late right before work and going straight there and kind of going to work and then like watching movies afterwards. So every day is very different and it depends a lot on your schedule and your friend's schedules and how they line up and how tired everyone is because there definitely are days where you've been working a lot of days in a row and you're super tired and you get home from work and just want to crash and go to bed. Um, so every day is pretty different. So it's hard to say like a typical day, but a lot of times... Um, we will watch a movie or like hang out after work, um, depending on the vibes. But I did get my hair done yesterday, which was not a typical day. Um, I don't really get my hair done. I've only gotten it done twice before and I just got highlights, but I got a balayage yesterday and the lighting's kind of weird right now, but I absolutely love it. Um, it was amazing. I did get a little sunburned, but I absolutely love my hair and I'm so excited about that. But um, I think that's all for this video. I am going to head to bed. I hope you guys enjoyed kind of just a random day in my life. And I'm looking forward to seeing you guys in the next video. Bye.